Hey guys, it's Brian with JMP Cycles. In front of me, I have the Shoei Neotech 2 modular helmet. Now, Shoei did a really good job at making this helmet quiet, unlike most of the other modulars that you see on the market. What makes them very loud is they have a lot of moving parts with a lot of areas for wind to get trapped or move across. And Shoei did a, a painstakingly job to create a aerodynamic helmet that is a modular that still stays quiet. Now, the first thing to take note is the ventilation system. Now, these do have some cool aerodynamic fins over them, but they are large pockets to allow air to come into, keeping your head cool, and a big chin vent to keep your face cool. Moving to the actual uh, chin bar itself, it is easy to manipulate with a gloved hand. Just use your thumb to lift up the front. And it's very uh, solid locking up and down so you know exactly where it's at. This helmet does come uh, equipped with pin lock and it does have a supplied clear pin lock shield that goes into it. If you don't know what pin lock is, it's very simple. It's a piece of internal plastic visor that goes into your face shield as it is and it creates almost like a dual pane window to give you a fog-free visor. One of the other key notes is the interior liner itself. Not only is it very comfortable, but this is one of the areas that Shoei focused on to keep noise down. So the cheek, uh, the cheek pads actually cup around your ears to kind of create more of a barrier for less wind to, uh, to get through and to come across, creating a quieter helmet. Inside that interior is your EPS liner. The EPS is that foam that protects your head uh, and absorbs all that energy uh, in case of a fall. That EPS liner inside of the Shoei Neotech is actually two pieces. So it does two things. It absorbs more energy because it's dual density and it creates a air gap to allow airflow to come through. So it's a little bit more ventilation. One of the last things around this out is the chin strap and it is a ratchet system. So it's super easy to use. So whether you're using a thick gloved hand or just a free hand, it's very easy to manipulate with solid clicks. If you're interested in this helmet or would like to learn more, head on over to jmpcycles.com where we have other videos showing you how to measure for your head shape and size. And then make sure to check the size chart to ensure you get the right size the first time you buy. If you'd like to see more product reviews or uh, gear reviews, hit us up on social media, subscribe to us on YouTube, and together we'll help you find what's next.